مرحبا واهلا وسهلا في درس جديد من تعلم العربية مع اي جي. Hello and welcome to a new lesson of Learn Arabic with اي جي. In the previous lesson we talked about parts of speech. أقسام الكلام. أقسام الكلام. We said that parts of speech in Arabic are divided into three groups. The first group is called حرف. حرف. A letter. And a letter is divided into also two parts. The first one, it could be just a normal letter like ba. And the second one, we call it a letter because simply it's not a noun or it's not a verb. And it consists of more than one letter like prepositions and the preposition fi. The second group is called ism. Ism. And ism also could be a proper noun like for example Faransa. Faransa, France, or it could be a normal noun like bait, house. The third group is called fi'l, and we use any verb in any tense like the verb ashrab. Al-yawm sawfa nata'allam an al-dama'ir. Today we will learn about some pronouns. Previously we learned about the pronouns we and I. We said we means نحنو and I means أنا. We also learned how we use them with some verbs. For example, I say أنا أحب السباحة. أنا أحب السباحة. I like swimming. نحنو نحب السباحة. نحنو نحب السباحة. We like swimming. Also, we learned about the pronouns huwa and hiya. Huwa means he and hiya means she. For example, I say huwa mu'allim. He is a teacher. Hiya mu'allima. She is a teacher. In Arabic, we don't use is, am or are. Wal'an iqra' الجمل التالية اقرأ الجمل التالية Read the following sentences You have only 10 seconds Let me read the sentences for you now أنا أسبح في المسبح أنا أسبح في المسبح هو يسبح في المسبح هو يسبح في المسبح What do you notice? Have five seconds to think about it. We notice that when we change the pronoun I أنا to هو he we change the beginning of the verb I say أنا أسبح هو يسبح so أنا أ هو يا also اقرأ الجمل التالية اقرأ الجمل التالية read the following sentences and take 10 seconds Let me read now the sentences for you. أنا أسبح في المسبح. أنا أسبح في المسبح. هي تسبح في المسبح. هي تسبح في المسبح. What do you notice also? Have five seconds. Also, when we change the pronoun I, أنا, to here, she, we change the beginning of the verb in the present form. For example, I say, أنا أسبح, أ, أسبح. It will be, here, تسبح, تسبح. So the rule is, we change the beginning of the present verb to match the pronoun. For example, أنا أ, أنا أ, أشرب. 
هو يا هو يا يشرب هي تا هي تا تشرب نحن نا نحن نا نشرب Now let's practice using the pronouns we learned أنا هو هي نحن with verbs with making the suitable changes You have only one minute to think about this and solve it So did you solve it correctly? Let's see. أنا أعمل أنا أعمل I work هو يعمل هو يعمل He works هي تعمل هي تعمل She works نحن نعمل نحن نعمل We work أنا أكتب أنا أكتب I write هو يكتب هو يكتب He writes هي تكتب هي تكتب She writes نحن نكتب نحن نكتب We write أنا أستمع أنا أستمع I listen هو يستمع He listens هو يستمع هي تستمع هي تستمع she listens نحن نستمع نحن نستمع we listen انظر إلى الجمل التالية انظر إلى الجمل التالية look at the following sentences you have only 30 seconds to decide what mistakes they have والآن دعونا نقرأ الجمل سويا Let's read the sentences together أنا يكتب أنا يكتب And the mistake is the beginning of the verb letter يا It has to be أنا أكتب أنا أ هو تكتب هو تكتب Mistake is letter ta at the beginning of the verb. It has to be huwa yaktub. Huwa ya. Nahnu aktub. Nahnu aktub. And the mistake is the letter alif at the beginning because with the pronoun we, nahnu, we use nahnu naktub. Nahnu naktub. Hiya yaktub. Hiya. يكتب. The mistake also the beginning of the verb letter يا and it has to be هي تكتب هي تكتب 
Thank you for watching. Our lesson for today is done. And thank you for the lovely videos you are sending me. Stay tuned. All these videos are going to be packed in one video that is going to be released in lesson 30. Don't forget to subscribe, like and share and also click on the link below to check your understanding of today's lesson. Shukran wa ma'a salama.